Hey yo, welcome back to Nunderson. Whoa, look at that long ass arm I just sent out. Alright. What happened last episode? I don't know. Leviathan, Duke Fishron, Brackish Clump. I said I would get it. Boom, we got it. And uh this is what it looks like. This you'll see three of them every now and then. Let's go up here and do it. Whoa! This thing as crazy as I remember it being. Uh, new team mod loader update. Juice told me that you can reforge uh, weapons in this team mod loader update. I don't know if it's just his weapons or what. You can reforge all the weapons. Okay. That's cool. Good on you, Juiced. Speed. I think that has enough speed. I should stop spending gold on this. Okay. Um, What do we get rid of? This. This sword. I don't want it. Plain and simple. What is this? Wait, what? Some sound. Oh, okay. We. I remember what that is. Uh, we're gonna we're gonna fight a boss. Obviously, this isn't gonna be the big event episode yet. So I was looking at my phone right there. Uh, we're gonna fight maybe Abyssion. I don't know. And probably definitely Plague Bringer. I don't know actually. Actually, let's do Atlas and the Ravager. Because those two seem in an interesting area. I feel like Playbringer is definitely harder than Atlas and the Ravager. Well, actually, I don't know. The Ravager is kind of hard. We'll go Atlas. He's for sure. So let's see here. We got to make the Stone Fist. Can I just make it straight up? Do I need to look into this recipe? I type Stone Fist. Can I make it? Not that Stone Fist. The other one. No, I cannot. Okay, that's fine. What am I missing? That Lizard Power Cell. Easy. That's easy to get. We will buy two of them. And then we'll put them inside of there. And we'll switch them to the regular Power Cells. Because that's how you do it. Power Cell. Boom. And then now, we should be able to make the Stone Fist very easily nice all right so what do i need do i got everything we need yep we're good we're gonna try out the brackish clump somebody told i should forge all my weapons shouldn't i yeah, don't worry about it someone told me the bubble knife is pretty op if i throw it away from an enemy and let the bubbles do all the work so maybe i'll keep it holy shit it spreads into three storm out of enemy it just breaks what the fuck is that a feather penguin feather interesting more one plus one percent damage to all types that's very interesting what the hell um hello cheat sheet i i'm guessing the mod loader update fucked up my cheat sheet i don't know why overhaul is even there it's not uh active right now all right uh i don't see a cheat sheet button anywhere maybe it's not even installed Okay, maybe I'm just blind, but we're gonna go. Do we have a guide here? No, I'm not playing vanilla terrain. I'm not gonna talk to the guy. We just won't worry about recipes this episode. So many penguins! The hell do you guys think you're doing? Just chilling in a line here. Alright, is this where I fight him? Oh, apparently, apparently so. Alright, where you at, boy? No, I'm trying to not hit him with the. Actually, let's use a brackish fla flash. Fla flask? Flask. I don't know why I said flash. What's going on here? Frame went into like 50 right there. Was it all the bubbles? It might have been all the bubbles. So he's not exactly the hardest boss. He's a cool looking boss. Don't get me wrong. He a cool looking stone bitch. But uh, he, ain't, he ain't that hard. Maybe we're just strong. We are pretty damn strong. Look at me avoid his outer circle. I wish his like outer circle did more. You shoot a couple lasers every now and then. It's like a forgotten enchantment. That's what it's like. It's like a bad version of when like the destroyer wraps you up in a circle. Where's he at? Okay. He always spawns above me. Let's see if I can get a bunch of pumpkins out. That's what I want to do right now. Get a bunch of pumpkins out. 
And we're gonna use the death rock. You know, we gotta use the spirit mod weapon on a spirit mod boss. It's not exactly effective. So when has this weapon ever been effective? We're gonna stop using it right there. <laughs> we're gonna throw this out. This weapon is effective. It's one of the strongest weapons next to Thunderson's glove. Use them. Those are our strong weapons right there. Okay. Let's just use this. I like this weapon a lot. I like its speed. And it does decent damage. It also splits. Which I guess all my weapons split. But that one just feels nice splitting. Whoa. I didn't notice there was that many pumpkins alive. Alright, so there you go. Atlas is dead. That was nice and easy. Like I said, not the hardest boss. I really... I have Cheat Sheet installed. Like, I updated it. Maybe, like, the update killed it. I don't know. But, uh... We'll keep... Keep one of the penguin feathers. They don't seem hard to get. And then we'll open up these treasure bags. Wow. Zealous the mountain. Uh... We'll sell one of the Atlas size. The one with the enchantment. And yeah, sell the weapons. So we got the Arcane Geyser. I don't remember what this armor does. <laughs> I'm trying to remember. We, uh... We're gonna figure it out. We're gonna teleport here... Oh, who's this? Joe. What's up, Joe? Oh, he sells blocks. Can I buy silt? Do you sell silt? You gotta sell silt, man. Come on. It's like building, basic, advanced, filler. Maybe silt was in there and I'm just not seeing it. Rumple stilt skin spinning wheel. The fuck? Alright, let's talk to the guide, you know, like old times. Old, when's the last time I talked to a guide? Uh, when I wasn't playing modded, that's when. It's just a melee armor. Melee magic armor set. We don't need it then. We can literally sell all of it because it doesn't do anything else besides craft that armor. Give me some gold. Only 11? What? What am I going to do with 11 gold? Okay, so store it. Toss it in there. Really quick. Let's, uh, let's do something here. Give me a campfire. Let's go ahead and spread some gnomage. Spread some good old gnomage. It's been a while since I spread some gnomes. Did I tell you guys about this? This prison? I feel like I did. Alright, um. What's going on here? Why is there blocks like over there like that? I don't know. How do I get out? I want to get over there. I want to play some gnomes in this area. Uh, over here, okay. We're going to play some gnomes because it's been a while since I've done that. And uh, I just feel like. No, now is a good time. We got a break in the action. Okay. Will they fit right here? That's the real question. Easily. They easily fit. All right, you guys enjoy down there. Now they're slowly spreading. We got, we got some right here. There's one over here. Zoom in. One right here. One over here. And then there's one here. There might be more. I might take out that stucco block idea and you may be like what's stucco block idea it was during a stream i had an idea that the gnomes would slowly take over the world like you see these are all stucco blocks it slowly just start forming everywhere but it feels like way too much work it feels like way too much work just for a little gimmick and i'm not gonna do it because of that uh but i don't know maybe maybe we'll do something look at this shuriken uh, chlorophyte glove I don't know if I ever show, showed that off. Probably not. But uh, moving on. We're going to do something else here. Uh, I don't know what boss. Damn, we're very close. We're very close to Moon Lord. We're very close to the end of this series. The Phantom. Would he be easy? No. I'll answer that. Ravager. Ancient Medallion. Let's try the Ravager. Ravager is a hard hitter, dude. He's a hard hitter. But I have faith. We need more lizard bricks okay that is no problem all right slight problem i cannot get to the uh lizard dungeon easily i don't know why the hell is wearing that i can't get to the lizard dungeon easily anymore because i don't have cheat sheets so uh I'll, I'll be right back a quick walk all right hopefully this is a good enough arena it's just a floor or uh it's just platforms i got this bug carapace plus two you feel one with the beetles nice uh let's just do it straight up that's all that i don't need any i don't need any preparations i just need some potions and some good throwing weapons and that's exactly what we got so 
I'm gonna do it. How do I teleport again? It's V. Whoa, I'm over here. Good old teleporting. Honestly, I should... no, we're gonna, we're gonna, never mind. Don't, don't even say anything. Just do it. Just do it. Don't even think about it. What's still not dead yet, dude? Just die already. You're gonna kill me. <laughs> Watch out for that missile chasing me. The missiles are so tiny. Like you see the little red like triangles. That thing tried to cut me off. I seen you. I seen you. That's right. Easy Ravager. Ah, oh, fuck. Hey, chill out. Fight is over. Y'all see those missiles? Those missiles. All right, round two. Round two. Do a combination of weapons here. Ooh, look at that. Grabbing onto him. Grabbing onto him. This is weird looking. We start off with this, and then we go to Nunderson's glove. Because it's easy to use that weapon at the beginning. Okay. Well, I could do a little switching here and there. Oh, my God. He's taking so much damage. He's taking so much damage. I thought this guy was hard, man. I thought he was hard. Calamity, you got to buff him. Go ahead, do you do your do your calamity thing where you change a whole entire boss because it gets beat easily. That's not even a roast, that's the truth. Alright, let's uh That's it. We killed him. That's all dude, he dropped a weapon. Hematomesis. Oh, he's always dropped this weapon. Or not always. He didn't drop it during the beginning of David. I think he dropped it like after David. Like the end. Flesh totem. Has enemy contact damage. That's not bad. I would love to see what it does it's a material so i'm gonna put it in there but i don't exactly have that luxury so uh, i think we're gonna end the episode off here we accomplished what i wanted to accomplish and uh you know that's how the episodes are i do what i want to do and then i i do you